New this morning, you can support men and women who serve our country and communities and at the same time support young girls learning life skills. The Girl Scouts Hometown Heroes program is officially underway. WSF 8 News reporter Bethany Davis is live at the 187th Fighter Wing at Danley Field this morning. Bethany, tell us a little bit how this works. Yeah, well, it's, it's pretty simple. It's really just all about saying thank you with Girl Scout cookies and making sure those cookies get to the people who serve and protect our communities. Carlin Edmonds is the CEO of the Girl Scouts of Southern Alabama. And this is Peyton. She is a Girl Scout with Troop 9327. Let's talk a little bit about the Hometown Heroes program. Explain what it is and how it works. Absolutely. Well, just like you said, it's about giving back. We teach our girls in Girl Scouts to give back at all times. We want them to know the importance of community service and giving back in their community. And Hometown Heroes is part of that. So it's our way of saying thank you uh, to everyone uh, who our Girl Scouts serve. So it's easy to give back through Hometown Heroes. Just simply buy some cookies and say, I want to donate these cookies to the Hometown Heroes program. It is really easy. Yes, it's very easy. And it's a great way to give back to our first responders, uh, to folks like the 187th Fighter Wing, which we're here with this morning. Um, also folks who work uh, within uh, you know, police, fire medics, we give back to a lot of different people. And giving back means a lot of different things to, uh, to everyone. Yeah, I was going to ask you, who's considered a hometown hero? Because I think we all kind of have our own idea of our own heroes. Absolutely, absolutely. Well, a lot of times we do give back to our, to our uh, brave military folks. Um, also those who are, again, firefighters, police, uh, police officers, folks like that. But also sometimes we give back to, to local nonprofits. Um, you know, those who, those who really, uh, who need a little boost. So we are glad to do that. It's our way of saying thank you to them. All right, Peyton, talk a little bit about how we can connect. How can we be a part of the Hometown Heroes program and connect with the Girl Scout to do that? Well, if he, if like, say for instance, you go across a group of Girl Scouts who are selling cookies. Like one time when I was selling my first booth for my new troop, um, someone came by and said, I don't want to buy any cookies. I just want to give, I just want to donate. And we were like so happy because like, yay. <laughs> like even though you do to buy cookies, you can still donate. Like you can go to a Girl Scouts neighborhood or you can call the Girl Scout office and you can even go on to our website. All right. Well, we're here. You can see these cookies are making their way into this building. We'll be here as the Girl Scouts honor the folks who work here at the 187 fighter wing thanking them for all the work they do to serve and protect us. Bethany, I love Peyton's energy this morning. She was so excited about those donations and you can tell that it's helping the heroes and making our Girl Scouts happy. It is. It's such a really great way to support the world's largest girl led business and give back to our community. Those who serve and protect us at the same time. All right, Bethany, we'll check back in with you a little later on. And Girl Scouts of Southern Alabama will match every donation and distribute it all to hometown heroes all across our area. Who doesn't love to say?